what's going on guys um so this is going to be part two of um chat episode 122 um obs crashed on me i'm you know i'm sure some of you understand how that is um but regardless uh thanks for checking into this and uh we're going to keep going with this chapter um we're pretty much just picking off here um i i was just seeing like the um um the from the shinsu orb um like the scales like kind of how Bam was like emitting those scales from leviathan a lot of the green ones are coming out in like in like a much like more like like grandeur scale like it's covering like the entire like room repeat i scratch that it's outside this is this is crazy he's emitting a crazy amount of power if anyone interrupts our conversation as of this moment I'll make everything in this nest disappear. <laughs> Yo, yes, watch is just quiet. What's that strange thing? I don't think it's Shinsu, says uh, Yama. The moment that Tremory revealed his Shinsu black hole sphere, everyone in the, in the tower could sense it. Everyone in the tower can sense it. All right, we're going to keep going. Those near and far, strong and weak. In that instant, oh, that's Kuhn. Everyone sensed, I feel something, his power. As if everyone had suddenly been summoned to a deep abyss. No one had ever felt anything like it before. It was suffocating. It would make your whole body feel like it was sinking. You could sense that your life was in danger, except for one person. He unfazed? But people in the tower felt it? Loose let coming? Got staying coming? So a regular bam, is it? Ever since it became known that you were in the tower, some of the other family heads and I have been discussing what to do with you. Some said we should kill you, while others said you should be protected. And some said we shouldn't bother someone climbing the tower according to the rules like you. I guess your presence here in the tower has caused a bit of a rift among us. Jihad didn't want to see us divided any longer, so he didn't take any direct action aside from giving orders to the army. King, being the king, Jihad had no doubts to find uh, to find the best possible solution for everyone. But some of the ten great family leaders made it clear that they want conflict, and so the <laughs> Gastang, <laughs> as they show him a silhouette. So the question of what to uh, to do with you became an uh, entirely different issue. The situation became such that even the family. Um, that even the family heads got involved directly. In order to stop the conflict, the king gave three orders to get rid of you, but unfortunately you're still alive. If the king had a, had a, a clear opinion on the matter, I would go along with it. But since that's not the case, I'm taking all the family heads' opinions into consideration. That's why I agreed to this proposal to summon you here. Like some of the family heads said, I didn't think it would matter if you died here. And like others said, I also thought it wouldn't hurt to spare you if you managed to survive here. Because if you because if you survive this battle, it means you're worthy of serving me. Serving you? All of that to say serve me? All of that to say serve me? You're about to be real disappointed, man. Uh, that's right. If I decide uh, <laughs> you're useful, you can serve me and not. And if not, I'll kill you. It's uh, That's how I work. Unfortunately, the conflict isn't showing any signs of stopping. He's just like a dominator. Like he has to like, like just like completely and utterly like dominate you. It's 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 actually like like kind of funny. There's no like like you know like no like you know like we might be able to like be friends, kind of equals, but like no like I have to dominate you. Um, I feel like it's if it's not like another like family head. Um, it, it's not gonna matter. Sorry, don't mind me. I'm I'm I'm, I'm patting my dog. She's right here. She's uh, she's kind of like whining for some attention right now. Um. All right. All right. Let's finish this 
so um, unfortunately the conflict isn't showing any signs of stopping system right and now it's gotten to the point that a clash among the families is unavoidable as a result your role in all of this is quite important it's only natural that you'd serve me if I decide you're useful to me. But those from the outside like us shouldn't be treated like animals. I know I'm holding someone dear to you hostage, but I've considered but I've decided to consider you an equal as a human being. Who's he holding hostage? Who's he holding hostage? And extend my hand to you. Would you like to join our family? What? <laughs> Your man's just like what? <laughs> what do you mean? I want to. I want you to join our family and become one of us. There's no better way to solidify a, pol a political relationship than through marriage. I'm sure you'll be a great use to me if you serve. The, if you survive this battle. Luckily, there are lots of outstanding girls in our family. I was showing the twins from um, the um, the name floor, the name, hunt, name hunt station. Um, we even have two two regulars who were chosen to be Jihad's princesses. Being one of the Jihad's princesses is a great honor, but I'm sure they would give it up to marry you. Now, let me officially make you an offer. I want you to marry one of our family's daughters and join the Lopopia family. What? <laughs> Yo, Bam just keeps saying, what? Join my family. I want you to be mine. Emphasis on mine. That's my offer to you. Bro, this is kind of crazy. Um, I know. <laughs> um, I, man. I can I completely understand why um, he wants he wants Bam. Like you've gone this far, like you show a lot of potential. Like if he were able to like to dominate Bam, by the time he's able to climb the tower, he's going to be unstoppable, right? So, you know he's going to be able to use this, serve Jihad, uh, have some sort of power probably over the other heads, and then maybe he can even be a little more like dominate you know dominate them like a little bit i'm sure he probably has some sort of like secret like fetish about like some shit like that um <laughs> if, <laughs> if if you watch naya he keeps saying that charmer is a freak i i believe it man i you know there, there's something there um but um it this offer to bam it's it's crazy and he's about to be really disappointed um so i wonder what's going to happen like once he says no like, is he going to snap? Is he going to just, like, destroy everything? Because his orb is just, like, up there above him, just chilling, you know? Um, and the people, but the the, cra the the thing from uh, this, you know, when I stopped in the middle, um, the, the, the power he was emitting was felt throughout the tower. So the other family heads were feeling him going off. They're like, yo, what is this guy doing? right like this guy is like just like flexing like a massive amount of power like his they were like <laughs> like what, what's he like what what's possibly happening that he has to do this so i'm sure someone like dustang is feeling this um i'm sure uh loose leg is probably feeling this and loose leg is aware of what's going on right so like i wonder if he is on some sort of like standby um sort of to the point where he's like all right um I'm coming. If if if, if Tremor shows up, I gotta come in, right? So I mean, it, it'd be a great time to see him, but um, we'll see. Uh, I I really want to know how they're gonna get out of this. Um, of course, Tremor told everyone to stop, right? But Hansel and you is still in the the warp ship, so is he still in there, kind of doing something? You know, um, we'll see. We'll see. Um. But yeah, well, next week's gonna be crazy too. Uh, this is this is gonna this is a, ne a nice group, group, group of chapters. So we'll see how everything goes. But um, that, that's kind of all I got for now. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Uh, let me know what you think of, of, of this offer, sort of what's going through Tremor's head head at this point right now. Um, 
and, and sort of how, how my, my day uh, got the situation. Um, but yeah, I'll talk, see you all uh, next week and uh, talk to you later. Bye.